it was my first meet since back at state, so I had I, I was I was fresh, like you said. I had no jumps in. My legs were ready to see what they could do. And to be honest, I had no idea what I could do because at practice I was jumping lower heights and stuff like that. But I just believed when I got to the track I would perform. The biggest thing I've noticed about Shane is he's a competitor. Um, when it's time to compete, he's ready to go. Uh, he's not a practice champ. I don't need practice champs. Uh, when, that, when those lights go off and, and he has to go out there and put on that show, we always say, he's going to go do it. And we saw the same thing at the state meet. You know, it, the entire year he was kind of uh, middle ground, jumping well, and then he showed up at the state meet and he has a phenomenal time and, and then just shows up at Notre Dame. And the beautiful thing is if you were there and you got to see him, he didn't even know what was what. You know, when he went over the, um, the 212, the, the 611 and a half, he thought it was like 6'9", and just the emotion that poured out of the kid, that's what we love here. That's what we want here. He just generally loves to do what he does, and it's, it's, it's pretty remarkable, pretty fun to watch. It felt perfect to me. It felt like everything was going to work out on my approach, and when I jumped, I just knew I had it. Part of it is just keeping grounded. Part of it is... Is, is keeping them on the course of what the plan is. You know, like everybody's gonna have a PR, but let's get, your, let's get your average five as high as possible. Let's make it so you're so consistent that when we show up at nationals, you can jump that consistently. And that's, that's where the, now the next message comes is, yeah, we got that big one out of the way, so not only these bars will scare you, uh, but we still need to get on average better. And that's our next thing is on average, can we clear those bars consistently? And as long as you, I think if you, kit, if you put the kids in the right position, they understand that, then it is easy. Um, but obviously, seven foot, seven one, seven two. We're gonna stare at him. We want to take shots at him, and, and for him to do what he did is pretty remarkable.